In this video, we're going over how to mirror your OnePlus N100 to your TV. Hey everyone, thank you for joining us today. If you want to stay up to date on all the mobile technology coming out and learn cool tips, tricks, and hidden features, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and tap the bell to turn on post notifications so you can be alerted every time you post new videos. Today we're going to go over how to mirror your OnePlus N100 screen to your TV. Now I'm going to show you two different methods to mirror your screen. Now in the first method I'm going to show you specifically how to uh, mirror the entire screen and everything that you're doing. So for example, if you're playing a game and you're trying to show your gameplay or you're trying to do a demonstration of how to use an app or a program on the phone, you can uh, see the whole process uh, in real time on your TV. In the second method, I'm going to show you just how to send a video from your phone to your TV. So, for example, if you're just trying to play a YouTube video or a um, Hulu video or Netflix, um, you'll be able to mirror your screen to the TV in that method. Uh, now, in that second method, it's great because you can basically send that video to the TV, but you can still use the phone to do other things while that video is playing. So. Just some background information there. Now, uh, one other preface. So in the first method where we're gonna be mirroring the entire screen and everything you're doing, you will need a Google Chromecast to make that work. If you don't have one, uh, I will have links below in the description of where you can buy one. And I also have a video that will show you how to set it up as well. So in the second method, you will be able to um, use any H uh, just about any HD TV or HD Smart TV um, or a Roku, Chromecast, Apple TV, uh, Fire Stick TV. All the major streaming devices will support the second method, and that's just sending the video to the TV. So, anyway, let's jump right in. Let me walk you through exactly how to get this done. I'm going to just slide my phone over just like this, and then you should see my TV screen right here, so you can see exactly what I'm doing and, and when it starts to mirror, so you can kind of follow and just see the process. I'm gonna go ahead and on the phone, swipe down from the top of the screen, swipe down again, and the first thing you wanna do is make sure your Wi-Fi is turned on. This button should be in blue. And make sure that your phone is connected to the same Wi-Fi network as your Chromecast. Now you will need Wi-Fi to make either of these methods work, just FYI. The second thing you'll need to do is tap on the screencast button right here. And we're just gonna tap it. And it's gonna show you all the devices that are um, plugged in and ready to uh, be casted to. So uh, this is the name of my Chromecast, Nunya TV. So I'm gonna tap on that. Hit start now. And give it a few seconds and you'll see now my phone is on the TV and everything I do on the phone is gonna show up on the TV. So this is great. Now I can also take the phone and I can rotate it in the uh, landscape position as well. You do need to make sure that your rotation lock is on, but this way I can rotate it and I can still show everything I'm doing on the phone in real time on the TV. I don't have any games on this phone at the moment, but uh, again, gameplay, uh, pictures from a trip, uh, this is a very useful method for showing specific things. You might have a video on your phone you're trying to show. Um, this is a great way to do it. And when you're finished mirroring the screen and you want to stop, you just swipe down from the top of the screen. Now you swipe down again and you just tap on the screencast button and hit disconnect. And that will stop your phone from mirroring to the TV. So that's our first method. You know, second method, um, it's a little bit easier. You just need to go to the app that you want to play the video from. So I'm going to go to YouTube and I'm just going to pick a video. So let's pick this video here. Now pause it first and at the top of the screen, look for this button, which is your cast screen button or cast video button. Tap on that, and here you'll see a list of all the different uh, devices that you're able to cast to. So for example, um, I do have uh, my Chromecast here, Nunya TV, I have my Office, which is, that's my Roku. And then there's also an option called Link with TV Code. So uh, on your smart TV, you will need to open YouTube 
go to the settings and then there's a setting that says link with TV code and um, when you select on the TV it's going to give you a code you then tap on link with TV code put in that code and then it'll allow you to send that video right from your phone to play on the TV for the sake of this I'm going to use the Chromecast again right here just tap on my Chromecast Give it a second, the video is gonna load, but you'll see YouTube is gonna show up on the TV and that video is gonna start playing right from your phone to the TV. And then once that video starts playing, you can then um, go back to your home screen. You can begin to do other things while the video is playing. So the video is on, I can now go home. I can go to my text messages. I can send messages. I can go on Chrome. I can basically use my phone like normal while that video is playing on the TV. If I want to control that video, I just swipe down from the top of the screen here. And here you can see, um, I can pause the video from here or play. I can fast forward through the video um, where this little bar is. And I can also hit the X here to stop the video from playing. So that's the second method that will allow you to send that video right from your phone to the TV. So two quick and easy ways. Um, obviously there's a little bit of setup you need to do. Hope you guys found this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Take care and as always, have a good one.